This ordinance change will allow for alcohol to be served on private property within Amarillo's Route 66 Historic District. The hope is it will bring more tourists and money to the business district during festivals. News Channel 10's Devin Darmstetter joins us. Stacy, previously alcohol was prohibited from being served within a fenced area, including private property and private parking lots. With the change, businesses can serve alcohol on their grounds during festivals, increasing revenue and promoting economic growth in the area. A recently approved amendment to a city ordinance was made in favor of the future of tourism in Amarillo. Generally, when you think of tourism and leisure travel, you think of big things like festivals and concerts. An ordinance was changed to clarify the definition of a public place typically where open containers of alcohol are illegal. The prohibition said during a festival, open alcoholic beverages were allowed, but it had to be everywhere. Um, so what we did was allow private property to um, fence, fence in private property, essentially, to have open containers in a more controlled environment. The Amarillo Convention and Visitors Bureau decided to be proactive in having the rules changed for the Centennial Route 66 Festival coming in 2026. That way we can be prepared and we have the opportunity to bring some adult beverages to the festival in a very responsible manner in the future if we so choose to. According to Amarillo Environmental Health, the revised ordinance will go into effect May 25th. Devin Darmstetter, News Channel 10.